Hi, Phil Aston here from NASA Mini Magazine with episode nine of the Jethro Tall Super Deluxe Edition series. And now we're in 1976. That's the year of Rainbow Rising, presence by Led Zeppelin and all sorts of different things were going on at this point. And this album kind of like, uh, after Mitchell in the Gallery, which as I said was a high point and one of my favorite albums, this one drops down. And it still isn't one of my faves, so that could just be me. But as you'll see when we go through it, there are the other aspects of this set that gives it, for me, an essential badge. So let's go and have a look. Next up, Too Old to Rock and Roll, Too Young to Die. 1976, uh, I think Jethro Tull began to feel as if the pressure coming from the press was making them feel as if should they still be around? Do people still like what they do? Never bought this one on vinyl, but I bought this on CD, which was the 2002 remaster. And as before, the booklets had were to a certain size. Quick essay by Mr. Anderson. Mimic the gatefold sleeve, of course, was the cartoon and the lyrics. And you're done. And you can get those really cheaply. So... Here we have the deluxe edition, remixed to 5.1 by Stephen Wilson. The 1976 TV show and soundtrack, five original LP tracks and unreleased bonus songs. And this is from 2015. Also, extensive article by Martin Webb on the preparation and recording of the album in Brussels, Monte Carlo. The aborted stage musical. Weekend TV special and the 1976 tour is a track by track annotation as usual. Lyrics uh, is obsession with motorbikes. Uh, the David Gibbons talks about how he drew the inner spread. Everything you'd want is in here. So you've got the stereo remixes, original LP tracks, outtakes, associated recordings, flat album transfer, DVD one, features. Um, TV film 5.1 to Auto Rock and Roll Too Young to Die, um, which is absolutely fantastic. Associated recordings, associated recordings again on DVD 2. You've even got the quad version as well. The quad version has also been included on some of the others as well. So let's have a look inside. And just like the original album, they've they've used the same kind of design, so everything flows in really well. So we're in 1976 now. Again, I've mentioned it before, haven't I? But the way the fonts, everything, the way the original album, they they could have easily just gone for the same font and all of these, but they haven't. They've tried to make sure that the design aspect fits in with the actual album. So you are back in the time. You're absolutely back in the time. And, you know, again, you know, Ian Anderson, very athletic guy back then, you know, the superb performer. So there's full story of the album. It's also a full story of stage gear for, <laughs> for rock bands of the time and changing haircuts. And some of the tracks here from the TV special. Um, you see here we've got uh, Cherry Glipsy from Pan's People. Um, some rather large drum sticks there. And uh, again, more pictures of the band and the full story behind the band. And then the cartoon, which is a story of an old rocker who thought he was past it, who suddenly finds out later on that people think he's really cool, um, who's modelled very much on Ian Anderson. And um, here Ian Anderson talks about the inspiration behind each of the songs, which is really interesting. Some more great photographs. Then we have the lyrics. And then the tour dates from the time with some nice press clippings and some behind the scenes photographs. And then the story about the strip cartoon, which was a big part of this album. It really was. Um, and I think that's superb. And then Ian Anderson talks about why he likes motorbikes. So you can see here that he really was the inspiration for that cartoon in many ways. And there he is, more recent times, still on a bike and outside his country pile. In fact, they're all on bikes here. Uh, and then we've got um, Carmen Remembers the late John Glasscock, sorry. And again, they've done this before, where they've mentioned members who have fallen and passed away. And this, I think, is also a really, really 
nice touch and they've even the discography just like they did before so you can track down other albums by former members toe fat is a great album by the way and that's the whole that's a great picture of ian and that's that set with some handwritten words at the back so that's too old to rock and roll too young to die by jethro Tull. so too old to rock and roll but too young to die a saying that would resonate for decades to come and of course and when this was made 1976 they were still youngsters weren't they jethro Tull? They were so absolute youngsters and they still looked like absolute full-on rock stars. I think where this set really wins is of course the, the DVD and the TV show and seeing the band at that period perform these songs and do this album and that's what makes this um, such a special set. So I certainly wouldn't, I would, there's none of these I would miss out. I think as I've gone through this and, and and listened to this set, and there's so much to listen to, and the bet there's lots of you out there who bought this and you probably got some of the discs you haven't even played yet, have you? Which is gonna be a subject of a future video. Um, but as you do this, you, you're kind of, and this is why the band should have followed this format, because it just makes you feel so much closer to the, not just the band, but all the people who were involved from the engineers, the press people, the managers, the artists, the additional musicians, it just brings you, and it then draws you back, well it does for me, it draws me back to being that, that little kid, you know, trying to find my way through the world and, and not realizing that all this music was around me. There was so much to discover. And for you youngsters watching this channel, you can now explore everything from where we are now to going back like a time machine and you've got all this to hand. So that is the 1976 album, Too Old to Rock and Roll, But Too Young to Die. And on episode 10, episode 10, we're gonna look at songs from the wood. So thank you very much. Thank you for watching. Thank you for subscribing and thank you for being part of the now speeding journey and encouraging me to do this and everything you do especially all my patrons and especially that uh, Clive Chris and Yogi and everyone else who's recently come on board it's fantastic now stay safe everybody and keep spinning those records and remember that music is the doctor and it is the healer it will change the atmosphere of any room that you're in so if you're feeling a bit with what's going on in the news stick a disc on and I shall see you on my next video.